you know what? You know what, Onision? You proved me wrong. You literally proved me wrong. Because here, I didn't think that you would hit a new low. I didn't think that you would can get any scummier than you already have. But the fact that you have proven time and time again that you are nothing more but a lying piece of shit dirtbag. It's enough evidence for the internet to see that you don't need to be on YouTube anymore. No, screw it. You don't even need to be on the internet anymore. Because you have proven time and time again that you have no respect for other people's privacy. You have proven that you have no respect for other people in general. And as long as you pretty much stroke in your freaking ego, and as long as your stupid YouTube videos get enough views, then you don't care. It baffles me that you're a 30 year old grown ass man and yet you had the brain capacity of a freaking 10 year old. Because this individual asked you to stop making videos about her. She asked you to leave her alone. Her friend asked you to leave her alone. But what do you do? You just keep on going and going and going. You just can't take no for an answer, can you? You just will find something to pretty much ruin somebody else's life, ruin their recovery, ruin everything about them, just as long as it gives you the views. Because that's all you care about. That's all you care about. You don't really care about this person. You don't really care that this person is getting better. All you care about is your video getting the views. All you care about is money. That's all you care about. You don't care that this person is trying to get well and that she needs respect for her privacy. And you don't even have the common decency to keep your mouth shut or to at least wait till she goes back online. You are a scumbag, Onision. A literal blatant scumbag. And I don't give a crap if you have 1 million subscribers. I don't give a crap if you have 5 million, 2 billion. I don't give a crap. Because your attitude, your personality, and just everything about you, it's just enough for me to pretty much say that you are literally the worst goddamn creator on this platform. I have never been so furious in my entire life to the point where I have to make a second video on you. Because you are so craving for that attention to the point where it's pathetic. But you know what? Screw it. We're here, we're at this point, let's go ahead and get into what Onision's been getting himself into now. So, my last video, I talked about the fact that Onision has been going around copyright striking people's videos and copyright claiming them because of the fact that they're using his um, clips and videos for fair use, which is commentary or pretty much transformative content. Now, this jackass has put himself back into the spotlight by talking about Eugenia Cooney because why wouldn't he and you're probably wondering why do I have a problem with this well for one Eugenia Cooney does not like Onision at all this is the guy who literally has made nothing but videos shaming her body shaming everything about her this is the same guy who made a cooking show about her dressed up and pretty much making fun of her problems and everything like that this is the same guy who's been making her illness worse. Like I said, Eugenia herself and her friend had to tell Greg to stop making videos about her. But what does Greg do? He keeps going. Even after she put takes herself off the internet voluntarily, he's still talking about her. Like, oh my God, my dude, do you not have any respect at all? Like, literally any respect at all. And I know most of his dumbass fans are going to be on this video like, oh, why don't you leave Onision alone? He's just proving that he cares and everything. He's just showing that he cares about Eugenia and yeah, 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 yeah. For, here's my, here's my, look, look. Here's my personal message to all the Onision fans. Stop sucking his dick. 
He knows that if he puts up a video about Eugenia Cooney, most of you morons are going to click that video and give him views and give him praise, trying to make him look like he's some kind of messiah. When in reality, he's not. He's a dirtbag who likes to pretty much use other people's problems to pretty much put himself in the relevance. To put himself back into the spotlight. When this is the most scummiest thing you could ever think of anybody doing. Like, this girl is trying to recover in peace. Like, she wants her space, but she can't even get that when there's morons like freaking Onision still making videos about her and pretty much making the whole situation worse. Like, it's gotten to the point where he's trying to put up an image saying that he's pretty much God's gift to Eugenia and that he was the main one that pretty much helped her in her recovery. No, Greg. No, you're not. You are literally the biggest scumbag in the entire freaking planet. And I know I said that a lot in this entire video, but what else can I say? He's a scumbag. He's making himself look like he's the one who's pretty much responsible for Eugenia's recovery when literally this girl does not like Greg at all. And if you want further proof that Eugenia pretty much doesn't, wouldn't even appreciate Greg making videos about her or using her name at all on social media, no matter what it is, if you don't believe me, here is a Twitter page that she posted up on her Twitter. Now, if you don't believe me, take a look at this. This was posted on February 11th. Hi, guys. I appreciate the concern. I'm taking a break from social media and voluntarily working on this with my doctor privately. Please respect that. But does Greg respect that? No. He doesn't. This girl wants to be left alone in peace, trying to take a break from social media just so she can work on what's going on with her. And this asshole can't even give her the decency of privacy. Like, this is literally egging me on right now. Like, literally, if you go on his Twitter right now, if you go on Anision's Twitter, you can tell... Um, that everybody is pissed off about this because here he is making a post about Eugenia Cooney and if you scroll down into the comment section everybody has already made it clear that Eugenia Cooney does not want him talking about her and she wants to be left alone I even went in there and pretty much posted up my own um, response to the whole damn thing I literally put it up I'm pretty sure you had nothing to do with her recovery and she said everything was going to be private Meaning that she is the only one with the right to post her own business concerning her health. Not to mention, it's already established she thinks you're a scumbag. Yes, I even put up scumbag on Twitter. And then, to pretty much go ahead and pretty much show Onision's stupid fans that he doesn't have her um, health in mind. I posted, so your fans can believe whatever bullshit you're spewing while I'm just going to leave this here right quick. And then I posted up the picture of she pretty much posted on Twitter saying that she wanted to be left alone. You could go on her freaking Twitter and see that that was the very last post she put up. As of February 11th, Eugenia was pretty much pretty clear that she wants to be left alone. And does Greg respect that? No, he doesn't. This is Onision we're talking about. This is the same guy who has no respect for people's privacy. This man is a sociopath. And the fact that his fans don't see that is pretty goddamn sad. Like, for real. And if you want further proof that Eugenia Cooney does not like Onision and she wants to be left alone, here's your proof. Some of you guys say Onision tells the truth. Um... I guess he gives his opinion on things, but it isn't necessarily the truth. Some of the stuff he says that is like, oh, like Eugenia parades her body around totally on purpose, knowing she's killing people, knowing she's doing this and knowing she's doing that. A lot of that stuff is not true. And you guys can say like, that's not an opinion. That is true. But the thing is that really is you guys' opinion. And it's actually not true. Because the thing is like, which is this is a big thing that I was trying to explain earlier is that you guys cannot really know what is like going through my head and you can't really know what a person's intentions are when a lot of you guys do not know me you don't know what kind of person i am or anything like that and honestly like on the internet i just do try to be a positive person i don't try to do anything wrong like my videos are not things like they're not videos promoting my body they're not videos promoting how I look or like being like, hey, you guys should look like this. Like, yes, I do do some outfit videos and stuff like that, but that's just me like making outfit videos. That's not me going and making a video 
being like, hey guys, so this is my body, this is how you guys can lose weight, and this is how you guys can look like me. Warn your audience not to achieve your weight. I can do that right now. Yeah, you guys shouldn't try to achieve my weight. I'm not ever telling you guys to try to achieve my weight or try to lose weight to look like me or anything like that. Like, you see, I will, like, literally say that. I will literally, like, come on here or, like, whatever, whatever, which is what I've been trying to say the whole time, but Onision does not want to ever put that in his videos. He doesn't ever mention that I've said this, and if he did, he probably just come up with some reason why I'm it's still not okay and why I should literally just like not exist I should just fuck like I should just go and like hide or something okay guys so if anyone is like underweight or overweight or anything like that should they not be allowed to be a public figure should they have to go like hide in their hide in their closet or whatever so nobody can ever like see them because they may influence someone like literally guys like I'm never purposely trying to trigger anyone I would never want to do that I just really try to make you guys happy as much as I can but sometimes like when there's people who sees him in these videos and just start attacking me like it's it sucks a lot and like literally here's like the thing you guys if i like if people like let's say somebody wants to lose weight or something like that um again i even said like while, while i was doing this broadcast that people shouldn't be trying to get down to my weight or trying to look like me i really just think everyone should accept themselves and be themselves and not be trying to be anyone else and that's like what i think um, and um, I'm not ever promoting people to look like me, even though a lot of people like to say I'm doing that. I'm just kind of come on, coming on here and making videos, and I don't feel like somebody, just because of like their size, shouldn't be allowed to do that. I just kind of feel like that's wrong for people to not be like allowed on the internet, or should it be like banned off the internet, just because of like their size. I mean, I, I just think that's like messed up. It would be a completely different story if I was coming on here and promoting my body being like, guys, you guys should look like me. You guys should have my body. This is how you can get down to my body. That I could understand. Acknowledge that people are suffering. I understand that maybe some people are suffering. And if they are, then I really am sorry to hear that. And I really want the best for those people. I really want them to like be able to accept themselves and not try to change themselves. I understand there's a lot of people suffering for a lot of reasons in the world, um, but I'm never trying to cause that, guys. And I just wish that some people would understand, you know, like a lot of you guys are just saying like, stop denying, get help. But you guys can't really just like be telling me like what to do like with my life or whatever, you know? Like I'm not trying to be rude here, I'm really not. I am always very afraid to say anything because I never want to sound rude, I really don't. In case you still don't believe at the fact that Eugenia pretty much um doesn't like um Onision and the fact that Onision is a total scumbag who pretty much um ruined this girl's life and her recovery, here's another video to prove you wrong. And it's like, of course, like, see, he still goes back to doing that. So it's like, I don't know, like, again, like, I don't wish bad on him or anything, but even the whole thing, like, when he was, like, tweeting me yesterday, I guess he deleted it, but he asked me if, like, I was okay or whatever. Um, he doesn't even follow me on Twitter. Like, after he kind of started making all these videos on me, he unfollowed me. And as far as I know, since then, he really hasn't liked me too much. Like, he keeps accusing me of all this stuff and how I'm influencing people and all this stuff, and it really sucks. And, um, yeah, like, I don't even know why he was looking at my Twitter, to be honest. I know he said in his videos because he was, like, checking in with me or whatever. But it's like... I just don't get it. I'm not making videos, like, promoting my, my body. Like, literally, like, me making something like an outfit video is not me promoting my body. It's just me showing outfits. And it's not me saying, like, oh, hey, guys, like, try to look like me. Try to, like, have this body or anything like that. So, I don't know. Like, again, like, I was totally giving him the benefit of the doubt. I was just like, okay, well, you know what? He says he's not going to make these videos anymore. That is cool. I will give him a chance. Like, great. But no, it's just like, that's not whatever happens with him. Like, he still just keeps doing this. So I just don't really know what to think with him. And I mean, it's fine. I mean, he can make videos about whatever he wants, I guess. But it just kind of sucks because then he starts, like, accusing me of all this stuff. But yeah, no, it just kind of sucks because then, like, he starts, like, accusing me of, like, all this stuff. And then it also, like, turns all these other people against me. Like, it literally, like, turns all these other people against me. And, like, I know that, like, some of you guys just think he's worried, but it's, like, Guys, trust me, <laughs> Onision has, has, like, done this kind of stuff with, like, a lot of people. I really don't think he's just doing it because he's, like, worried. <laughs> I think he just can't cope with his own problems. I don't know. Like, 
he he picks like certain people to just keep making all these videos on it is so insane um and i i don't know like again like i hope if that is why he does it i mean i think he does it because he he he, he likes to try to get like views and attention on himself but i think that if it is because you know obviously you know that's another thing i kind of feel like he already has a lot of like mistakes that he's made and a lot of like not so great things that he's done. So the fact that he kind of like keeps like pointing out what he thinks is like wrong with everyone else and trying to make everyone else into the bad one, it, it's just kind of like, I don't know why he needs to do that. <laughs> no, like that's the thing with Onision. It's like, he kind of like tears apart at everyone. Like he, he like okay if he thinks like you're too skinny then he keeps picks on you for that but then if he thinks you're like too big for his liking then he does that and it's like i just i just don't get why he needs to like judge everyone so much he's dumb as f like thanks kaylee yeah and it's like i'm not trying to like name call him or get like you guys to go hate on him or anything like that but i don't know i just like really just do not see the point of him doing it like it's kind of just like at this point why is he even like still doing this? I called it yesterday. He was gonna make a vid. He makes more money on you than his other vids. Yeah, no, Jack, you were you were actually totally right on that. Like, I don't know. I was literally just kind of like, okay, like maybe he's. I didn't think he was really gonna do that because like I know he said that he's not gonna make drama videos anymore, and I know that he also said that like his last video was like his final video or whatever but it's just i don't know i get you you really never know with him um so like i don't know it is just ah i don't know she doesn't know what to think of him she doesn't know what to think of him and i don't blame her because with greg you never know what to think with Gray. You tell him not to do something, what does he do? In his small pea brain, he goes and does it. But hey, what more can I say? If his dumbass fans want to keep believing him to be a savior and everything, especially the fact that the girl that he's supposedly helping pretty much confirms the fact that he's a total scumbag to begin with, but hey, it's all up to them. They want to be morons, let them be morons. I'm just going to go ahead and put it out there, and I will literally give Onision this message myself. Onision, you are a piece of crap. You are literally trash. And the fact that you're pretty much using Eugenia Cooney's name again, just so you can pretty much get more views on your video and to use her name to get more money and to trick all these people that follow you into thinking that, that you're God's gift to Eugenia or anybody else for that matter. I'm just going to go ahead and say that I don't support the things that you do. I don't. And honestly, this, you can copyright claim videos. You can pretty much talk crap about anybody on the internet. You can pretty much make up some stupid bullcrap scandal about another YouTuber and based off of whatever goes on in your stupid little brain, and then you can talk about that crap for months until finally somebody calls you out for being so full of shit. But if there's one thing I will not tolerate is you using another person's illness after they're trying to live out in private to get better. The one thing I will not tolerate Onision is you using another person's illness just so you can get more views. You are literally a piece of shit. And honestly, I don't know how many more videos I have to make until I get through the message that you are literally the most god awful human being that I have ever come to hear of. Like, literally, you are the most god awful human being on the face of this planet. And the only person that you're lying to right now is yourself and your stupid fans. I have nothing against Onision's fans, but the fact that I have to go down in the comment section and hear them say that he, this guy cares and, oh, thank God, Eugene is okay and everything like that, I'm willing to bet half of you pretty much followed up Greg when he was pretty much going up against Eugenia and pretty much making her life worse. I'm willing to bet that a good majority of you were the ones that pretty much attacked her and pretty much called her names and pretty much made things worse for her. I am so sick of Onision's drama. I'm sick of him starting the drama. I'm sick of him pretty much 
throwing it on other people. I'm sick of him pretty much trying to make other people's lives worse. All because of the fact that he can't learn to keep his mouth shut and to keep his business to himself. But you know what? One of these days, Greg, it's going to catch up with you. It's going to catch up to you. And when that day comes, I hope that will be the day where you two will finally see the type of crap you put on this platform and they will have enough people listening, well, enough people telling them, and then they will listen to take your channel down. I am not one to pretty much say somebody's channel should be taken down. That's not my call. I'm not one to pretty much wish that upon anybody. But if there's one person I think deserves it more than anybody else on this platform, is you, Greg. It's definitely you. And no, this is not a threat. This is me being for real honest. You do not deserve to be on this platform if you're going to keep using it to pretty much boost, boost your freaking views and to try to get more money and make more money off of somebody else's suffering. That is disgusting and low. That is totally disgusting. And I am sick of it. But anyway, guys, that's all I have for this video. I hope, I, I hope to God that Onision will take down those videos. I'm literally hoping he will take down those videos. Because for him to pretty much make those videos in the first place after Eugenia made it clear that she wants to be left alone and she wants privacy and he doesn't even respect that, that's what pisses me off more than any damn thing. You need help, Greg. Definite help. You are literally a sociopath. You need freaking help. So whatever. If his fans want to follow his follow every single bullshit he spews out, that's fine. I really don't care. All I know is that I hope to the bottom of my heart, Eugenia is feeling better. I hope that she is recovering well. And I hope that when she does make a return to this platform, Greg leaves her alone finally. Seriously, Greg, leave Eugenia alone. She's made it clear that she doesn't like you. She's made it clear that you done more to ruin her life than help her. So this is from me and from everybody else that is concerned about Eugenia. Leave her alone. And you can make a video if you want to responding all the hate that you're getting. Because guess what, Onision? This is just amount of the hate that you deserve. Because we are getting so sick and tired of you thinking that you could say or do whatever you want. And you're not going to suffer consequences for it. And I hope your channel gets taken down one day. But anyway, guys, that's my video for today. And I'm going to try my damn the hardest to pretty much like not let this get to me. Because right now, Onision is just pissing me off along with a lot of other YouTubers. And this shit is just, it's just aggravating me. It's really aggravating me right now. But anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed the video and everything. Please leave a like if you did. Be sure to hit that subscribe button and ring the bell just so you can be notified and everything. I also have a Patreon that's set up and everything. If you want to go ahead and check that out, pretty much donate a dollar, social support. I, I don't care at this point. I really don't. But honestly, I hope Eugenia is feeling better. Onision, just, this is a personal message from me to you. F*** off.